Hello everybody, what is up? My name is Nana Vinity and today it is the first ever episode of Terraria Modded Season 3. Guys, it is time, it is time for a huge mod pack See, series. As you can see, we just got a Thorium Bard weapon. Now with this, I'm just going to put all the mods on the screen. As you can see, they're on the screen right now. And we have big names like Calamity, Thorium, Shadows of Abaddon, Sacred Tools, uh, Fargo's mods, uh, Elements of Woken as well. All of that stuff. But first, we have some stuff to actually inspect in our inventory because... Look at all this stuff. So let's go through the stuff that we get in a hotbar first. Family heirloom. Do we get anything? We get defense. Pretty cool. Key to the heart from Shadows of Abaddon. It's consumable, but I don't know what to do with that. Elemental capsule from Elements Awoken. Awakened mode and sanity. 75% more enemy life, defense, and damage. New harder boss AIs and stats. Give me that. Mystic gemstone, void blood heart. Ooh, yeah, now nah, we'll, we'll, we'll skip that one. We'll skip anti buff as always. Um, okay. Revengeance. Death. Malice. And Eternity Mode. Not intended for use with other content mods or modded difficulties. Is it now? Nah. Nah. Come here, Deviant. Give me my gift. There we go. <laughs> oh, wow. We got an Instavator as well. Oh, that is really good. Mini Instabridge. Oh, wow. Guys, we are actually stacked already. Just going to uncraft that stuff. So, this series is basically... It's just... Really. I, the best way I can describe it is just like... Extremely big. The thing is, it's not intended to be very challenging, but, whoa, oh, bard class, oh dear, it's not intended to be very challenging, it's just, I don't know, it's supposed to be fun, but also, you know, adding, having all the difficulties, it counters having so many mods active, which would mean that I have, what the? This tree leads to nothing. Angry. Okay. We have some slimes up there. Squirrel staff. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so the plan is, hopefully, to get some meteorite to make a star cannon. I I would like a star cannon. Because we're going we're going old school as well. We're going ranger. Oh my god. Killing these slimes. Jesus. Oh my goodness. What have I gotten myself into? But, I'll tell you who else has gotten into stuff. People that aren't subscribed. I just want to tell you guys, that's only a small percentage of you are actually subscribed. So if you're not already, please do so. It helps out the channel so so much i don't know if you guys have noticed but i might sound a bit sort of nasally that's because i have a really really bad cold at the moment so i do apologize if you guys hear me like do a slight sniffle because yeah it's pretty bad but you know what is not bad our members thank you to our members necromancer elmo 2.0 creamy 2.0 and mother slayer 21 thank you all for being a member I very much appreciate it, my friends. Anyways, so the plan is for today, probably just to set up shop, get some wood. We'll get the NPC house builder up and going because we need that. Do I have any iron? Might get some from these bags. Ooh, a shiny red balloon. I'll take that. Counterweight, don't need. Cloud in a bottle, I'll take that. Bloody spine. Uh, well, I have corruption, so... <laughs> yeah, that's that's useful. Now, I actually have the Fargo Souls mod DLC. As you guys saw, recipe browser taking a little while to load in there. Oh god. 
Jesus. Wow. Okay, that, that is lagging. Okay. Okay, so let's go... Oh, I don't know. Soul of Eternity. We now need Soul of the Siblings, which... Actually, yeah, that, that's that's fine. That's This is the usual stuff. Then we have the Thorium Soul, the, <laughs> the Calamity Soul, and the Sacred Tools Soul. So we have three more souls to collect now. Oh, 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 God. I'm actually looking forward to it, though, guys. I am actually looking forward to it. Because it's just going to be very fun. Vagabond's soul. Oh, yes. Vagabond's soul is just all the rogue items. Which goes into the soul of the universe as well. Oh, yes, of course. Bard's soul and guardian angel is also thorium. Oh, wow. Oh, guys, it's a lot to unpack. It really is. Now, I don't know what the theme of the housing should be. So, if you guys just let me know in the comments what the theme of the housing should be in this. Because, obviously, in Malice Mode, I was, like, red and black because, you know, it's quite, you know, quite hard, quite bloody. But, with this, what should the theme be? Because, of course, this is supposed to be more fun, more, sort of, uh, not fast-paced, but just more laid-back, more relaxed, but also still got that challenging aspect to it. So if you guys let me know, if any of you are ast astounded builders out there, then of course, please do let me know. Anyways, let's just get a storage crafting interface down in the heart. And the 16 storage units. You know, that's very generous, Deviant. Thank you very, very much for that. Now, we can put all this in. Like so. Uh, take the recall potions. Take the lesser healing potions. Get a workbench out. There we go. Now we need a furnace. We need stone. Okay, Slime, I'm going to face you now. God damn, 39 damage. That Slime dealt 39 damage to me. Yikes. Although I do mine very fast in this, which is pretty good, actually. Oi, Worm, what are you doing? Yeah. Oh, I get, I get guilty for that. Weapons dulled by the guilt of slaying innocent creatures. Oh dear, guys, I can no longer go on a tirade. How saddening. Anyway. Oh, what? Ah! Oh, I can't double jump. Puff in a bottle, so... Oh! So it's like the puff in a bottle is like the cloud in a bottle. I can't uncraft this either. Huh. Oh, well. I might as well take it off because obviously it's just a redundant accessory. Torch. Torches. Oh, we have enough torches. Do we not have enough uh, stone? Oh, that's because it's in my hot bar. It's not even in. It's not even in! There we go. Okay. Now, let's just go and explore for a bit. Maybe find a cave. Oh, boy. Guys, I'm not going to lie. Eternity mode with all of these mods. I really wonder how it's going to go. Because, of course, I might have to turn it off, but we will see. I hope I don't. But if if it comes to it, I might have to. Just simply because. Because it also might mess up drops. Because I know you get a true mode activator from the Moon Lord. Of course, true mode belongs to Shadows of, Shadows of Abaddon. But, of course, I, I, I think I know what it is. So, if I don't get it, I can always just cheat sheet it in. Because, of course, we're activating true mode when we get to it. Oh, Nice little snow house here. I can't set my... Oh, dear. Oh, God, that snowball's gaining health. No. Oi. Oi. No, don't gain health. Ah, yeah. Celestial magnet. Mm. I'm going to have use for that. Considering I'm ranger. No. 
Of course, the snow biomes this way, though. Of course, it has to be. But because we literally have to collect everything, I'm also scouting out for good places to fish. I know I'm really over preparing for these souls because, oh god, drowning. Cold drowning. Oh dear. Look at how many effects I have. <laughs> oh no. Oh lordy. This is going to be a long day. Okay, squirrel, you're not affected, but oh my. You are... Vicious penguin. Oh no! I forgot that Fargo... I forgot that Eternity Mode just makes... Um, innocent creatures blood moon at night. Blood moon? My body's wasting away. Oh my days. Oh my days! I should have taken some shurikens or something. Oh no. Oh! <laughs> Corrupts and vicious penguin. Oh my. Holy moly. Guys. I got mauled. I full on got mauled there. I need to take some like throwing weapons or something until we can get a star cannon. Actually, to be honest with you, I'm probably just going to be a jack of all trades. I can I'm probably just gonna switch between classes if it's needed. Because this is a pretty, pretty intense mode pack, as you guys can see. Anyways, uh, copper, no. Need an anvil. Still don't have the materials for an anvil. Disappointed. Goodie bag. Wow. I got two of the same. Can I uncraft these now? Ah, uh, dear. Anyways, can we get going on the housing? Maybe? Need 10 of each. House enabler. However, we don't have an anvil, so we can't get the prison builder. Okay, you know what? Instavator time. Here we go. Do not use if any important building is below. I don't know if there is an important building below me or not. And also, I'm getting... I'm going insane because of the darkness. Yeah, this is, this is, this is very... Ooh! Ooh. Please tell me we get a brilliant harvester off of the bat. No, just sapphires. Okay. Okay, you're fun. You're fun, sir. But, we do get a life crystal. That is good. Das ist good indeed. Okay. Hey. Hey. Let me up. There we go. Down. Hmm. I really hope I didn't strike through any important building. Otherwise, I'm going to regret it. Ooh. Lapis. Lapis. That's the armor that I need for ranged. I can't mine it yet. Oh no. Lapis is from Sacred Tools slash Shadows of Abaddon. For you guys that didn't know. And it's basically your ranged armor before Necro, I think. Or it might be equal to it. Ooh, Enchanted Staff. Ooh. Oh, I clicked off the game. That's fun. That's very, very cool. Ooh, Onyx. What does this make? I believe we need this stuff. Yeah. Onyx ring to make the ring. Which actually doesn't make anything. I thought the ring would have gone into something Fargo's, but I guess not. Black phase blade. No. Petrify. Magic staff. All this stuff. Oh my. Wow, I'm actually surprised that none of it goes into any thorium stuff. What ore is that? Is that thorium? Like, the thorium ore? I think it might be. Which means I don't think I'll be able to mine it just yet. So much stuff! I love it though. I actually love it. 
I love having so much content to ex like. Oh god, we got a Draconite Elemental from Elements Awoken. Enchanted staff it up. Oh, I clicked off the game again. That's gonna be an issue. No, it's gonna it's gonna laser me. Oh dear. Okay, it's so far. This enchanted staff seems quite good. Although this Draconite Elemental just loves to be a douche. Come on. Oh banner. Oh my days. There we go. Oh no. Oh no, what's beneath me? What is that? What is that? Congealed slime or something? Oh no. Whenever, by the way, in eternity mode, if something emits an aura like that, you know you're going to have a bad time. <laughs> Lime potion. It has a foul smell about it. Oh. Just a healing pot. Oh, okay. Let's put on a shine for you guys, actually. Right, let's let's see if I die to these hoplites within the first... Oh! No! Uh-oh. Dynamite! Run! Oh, it actually hit them. Oh, and it is Thorium. Bye! <laughs> Suckers! I got some Thorium, but can I harvest it normally? What is this? What kind of bat is that? Vampire bat? Oh boy. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end it off there. I'm just going to, off camera, I'm just going to basically just try and get, try and gather stuff, become more powerful, because, well, I believe Thorium actually goes into Thorium armor, which would, yeah, it should go into an enchantment. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Anyways, I thank you all so much for tuning in to this episode. If you have enjoyed, then please do smack a like on it. And subscribe because it's only a small percentage of you are. Thank you to our members once again. And I will see you all in the next video. Don't forget to tell me what the base theme should be as well. Stay inside, stay safe, watch them ads. Bye. And stay awesome, guys.